Hi everyone, uh, I'm Ben, Engineering Manager at Statbit. I'm here today with our CTO and co-founder Simon and our software engineer Roddick, who are around the uh, room at the moment. Please come and chat to us anytime if you want to know any more about Statbit. Um, we're excited to announce today that to celebrate the start of um, Jamstack Conference London, Statbit is now out of private beta and open to all users. So for those of you who haven't heard of us before, Statbit is the easiest and fastest way to create Jamstack websites. Creating modern websites requires integrating with many different tools, many of which you have to set up every time you want to start a new project. Statbit takes away all this hard work and allows you, to, you, your customers, or your company to build modern Jamstack websites in minutes. All right, well, let me show you just how quickly you can start getting up and running on Statbit. So with just a few clicks, Statbit will automatically create, configure, and deploy a website that's ready for you, your clients, or your company to edit within minutes. So hopefully, by now, you're asking yourself, exactly how does this work? So we'll start by finding the right theme for you, your clients, or your company's needs. Currently, our closed beta, well, previously, our closed beta launched with a selection of hand-picked themes licensed from Pixelarity. Over the course of the beta, we've expanded the selection by adding more each week. All of our themes are responsive, semantic, and search engine optimized. With so many new and exciting tools for creating static websites out there, it can be time consuming and labor intensive to set up a new project in a tool you've never used before. Statbit takes away the need to know how to structure your website to work with some of the most popular static site generators. All of our starter themes work seamlessly with Jekyll, Hugo, and Gatsby. So pick your favorite and let Statbit worry about what files and folders to put where. Statbit gives you the power to experiment with new ways of creating and managing your website's content. So you can pick from some of the most popular headless CMS on the market, and Statbit will automatically provision and create a content model to match your chosen theme and site generator. Currently, we support Forestry, Netlify CMS, Contentful, and Dato CMS, but we're looking at adding new integrations in the same way as we're looking to add new static site generators over time. All Statbit websites live as Git repositories, so you have access to all of your code at any time. Simply connect your Statbit account to GitHub, and your website will automatically deploy to Netlify in no time at all. If you don't have a Netlify account, don't worry about that either. Starting today, Statbit will deploy your website, and thanks to Netlify's automatic deployment process, you'll be able to access your website for 24 hours and claim it at your leisure. To date, our VE users have created thousands of websites using our selection of hand-picked tools. But as well as going public with our beta today, um, we're also very happy and excited to announce the introduction of custom themes. Starting today, you can create your own themes and continue to enjoy the speed and ease of use of Statbit. We've created a set of tools that give you the power to build themes for any of our supported static site generators and CMSs. These tools are uniform, the uniform theme model behind Statbit that seamlessly maps your content and layout to your chosen CMS, and Unibit, a powerful tool for creating, validating, and transpiling custom themes to your favorite site generators. Uniform enables Statbit to provision your themed content model with a growing selection of headless CMS. Statbit uses a powerful content model defined in your statbit.yaml configuration file to convert content, front matter, and data into format your static site generator expects. There's no configuration needed with any of the um, CMSs, so it's all automatic out of the box. 
StatBit.yaml gives users, clients, or companies the ability to create fast, secure, and low-maintenance CMS-powered websites in a single click. And that's something we'll be going into a little bit later on. As long as your theme is structured schema driven by Markdown for content and has, can support JSON, YAML, or TOML for data and configuration, you can use Uniform to bring it to StatBit. Unibit's powerful transpiling engine enables you to write your theme once and stay site generator agnostic. As new site generators are added to StackBit, any theme built with Unibit will automatically work with them. To show you just what's possible with Uniform Unibit, I'd like you to showcase two third-party custom themes that are also launching today. By adding a StackBit.yaml content model, David Darns, the creator, who's actually with us here today, <laughs> the creator of a Jekyll board paint theme, Alembic, was easily able to bring his popular theme to StatBit and create a Jekyll starter kit. So from today, you can go off to that starter kit repository, click on the Create with StatBit button, and automatically provision a site um, in your favorite current, uh, as for Jekyll, but in your favorite CMS of choice. So any of our CMSs that are supported on StatBit will also now be supported um, for users of Alembic. Snipcart makes it easy and simple to add a shopping cart to any Jamstack website. Process takes minutes. Snipcart have used Unibit to build Planty. It's the first e-commerce ready custom theme for Slackbit. So Planty gives you everything you need to get an e-commerce website up and running within minutes on your choice of site generator and CMS. So similarly today, that theme is launched, and you can head on over to the repository, hit the Create with StatBit button, and have a theme up and a website up and running within minutes. So if you'd like to start building your own custom themes today, there are three ways to do so. The first is to install the Unibit CLI tool via NPM and create your own project using our starter theme universal. You can do this in your local development environment, kicking off Unibit develop. You could also fork one of our existing starter theme repositories. All of these are, kind of are open source now and available on GitHub underneath the StatBit HQ organization. Or you can start thinking with our starter theme right away in Code Sandbox today. We provided plenty of documentation and examples to help you get started with Unibit and custom themes at docs.statbit.com. And we're also holding a lunch and learn session today, which is here we'll dig into exactly how we can start creating your first custom theme using Code Sandbox. So if you'd like to come and join us at 12.40 and find out about how we create our first custom theme, then please stop by and ask us any more questions. But thank you very much for your time.